Hi guys, so today we are taking it all the way back to the 60s with the 1960s inspired um, beehive updo. As you guys know, the beehive was very, very, very common in the 60s. And I was checking through our YouTube and I didn't really see anyone on black hair, so I decided to create a tutorial for that. So you're just going to need bobby pins, a hair tie and hair clip to section out your hair. And ad advice that you stretch your hair before you start this step. So the first thing we're going to do is that we're going to section out the front part of our hair for the bangs. Then for the rest of our hair, we're going to divide it into two. So a top and a bottom half. Then you tie up the top half out of the way. So we're working on the bottom part first. Then you divide that part into two equal halves. Then you make sure you fluff each half really detangle it and fluff it so it looks really smooth then we're gonna twist the two sides together and adjust it then secure with the bobby pin so now for the top half you're gonna grab some hair in the middle of your head directly at the crown grab some hair then roll it down and pin it with a bobby pin. So this is what's going to create the base for our beehive. Once you pin it down, you're going to adjust to make sure it's as big as possible. If you really want height with the beehive. But if you don't want it too high, you can let the roll lay flat. So you see, I'm just adjusting it to make it as big as possible. And after that we're just going to take the remaining pieces and just wrap them on top of the roll that we just made so you take one piece stretch it and fluff it out then you fold it on top of the hump then you take another piece and do the same thing and make sure you arrange it and keep them in place then you secure the back with a bobby pin And then you do the same thing to the other side. people normally did like different things to the front of their hair some people let the bangs fall in their face some people push it to the side so because my hair is kind of long I'm going to roll it and pin it to the side as long as you get the beehive part you really can do whatever you want in front and yeah just adjust it and make sure that it fits your face so this is what everything looks like at the end of the day. I even tried to do some heavy mascara and eyeliner on the eyes because apparently the eyes were really the main focus of the whole look in the 60s. You guys know I'm not, I'm very very bad at makeup, I'm not a makeup person, so I tried my best, I swear, I actually tried my best. <laughs> I 
so yeah thank you guys for watching let me know what you think about it in the comment section bye oh yeah don't forget to rate comment and subscribe as well